All right, David Harry here. And in this video, I'm going to be doing a picture quality test running Fortnite on an Apple iPad 2020 and also on a Samsung Galaxy Tab S7. Now, what I'm gonna do in this video is basically put the Galaxy Tab S7 to its highest possible quality running over HDMI as a mirrored screen capture. And I will then do the exact same thing on the iPad. Now for this particular test, the limiting factor here is actually the S7 because it will only do 30 frames per second with its maximum quality and stuff. So what I'm gonna do here is run this first and then what I'm gonna do is replicate the same settings on the iPad and then run that and record both of them screen mirrored through HDMI. Now I'm gonna try my best to try and do the same type of movements on both of them. So we're gonna see like for like as more, you know, as best as possible with this test as a go through through the game. It's not gonna be competitive gameplay. It's literally just to test what the graphics look like. Now also as well, what we're gonna see here are both of the actual devices screens being mirrored straight into the middle of a 16.9 frame. So that means we're gonna see black bars on the sides when we look at the S7, and we're gonna see bigger or wider black bars when we're looking at the iPad on the screen. But don't forget, we are actually seeing exactly what both of these tablets will look like when they are in mirrored mode and the important take from here is the quality of the picture as well all right so that's probably about it then for the explanation for this video so what we're going to see are three takes the first take is going to be two minutes of a walkthrough chopped up on the galaxy tab s7 and then like i say as best as possible i'm going to try and copy the same movements and do it on the second take with the ipad and then after that i'll do a split screen between the pair of them so we can get a clearer idea of how they both look and then i'll come back and do a little bit of a summary after that
Okay, so to a bit of an end summary then, and I think it was probably gonna be quite obvious as you were watching the video as to which tablet actually produces the best kind of like render quality and resolution and stuff, and that is the iPad. Now, the S7 is a fantastic tablet and is undoubtedly the best tablet out there for Android, but when it comes to pure graphics for games, so far I have not seen the S7 beat the iPad on any of these things. So the iPad seems to be a little bit better as far as like, you know, full blown quality and render resolution is concerned and stuff like that and rendering quality. Now, I am not kind of putting them up against each other to say which one is better because I'm not a fanboy of either of these things. I will play games on absolutely anything, me. So I'm just like, you know, a casual gamer who just enjoys playing the odd game no matter what it's on. But I just think that these tests are probably going to be a bit interesting for people who are dedicated to like, you know, one or the other. And maybe we'll give people an appreciation of one or the other if they don't use them themselves, you know. So yeah, like I say, both of them are fantastic tablets. There's nothing wrong with them. And if you want to kind of look at it in a different way, there's quite possibly a lot more games on Android than what there is on iOS. However, iOS just generally looks a bit better than what Android does. Okay, so there you go. That's my take from these types of videos that I'm doing. And don't forget as well to keep an eye out for more of this type of stuff that I'm doing. Also, if you've got any ideas for any kind of comparison stuff between the iPad and the S7, or indeed just stuff about one or the other. Let me know in the comments section to this video, because if it's kind of stuff that I can do fairly easily and straightforward, like I'll try it. You know, I'm kind of up for any kind of good old messing nearly about type stuff with anything to do with these two tablets. So yeah, any ideas you've got, let us know. And if I can get around to doing it, I most certainly will try it. Anyways, if you've liked this video, please give us a thumbs up. Also consider subscribing to my channel, clicking on that bell notification icon thing and all that funky stuff. And the last thing that remains for me to say right now is, I'm David Harry. Thank you very much for watching this video. Take care and goodbye now.